Welcome to Infigam friends. In today's video, we are having one very interesting question from radical equations. We'll be solving fifth root of x minus 20 whole power 5 minus 2 equal to x minus 22. And here we will find all possible solutions. So let's get started with our equation itself. Fifth root of x minus 20 whole power 5 minus 2. Now right hand side can we write 22 as 20 plus 2. So it will become x minus 20 minus 2. Now you can see x minus 20 x minus 20. So we will consider our substitution x minus 20 equal to a. So our equation will become fifth root of a power 5 minus 2 equal to a minus 2. Now I will multiply both sides with minus 1. So fifth root of with minus sign a power 5 minus 2 equal to 2 minus a. Now I will take this minus into this radical. So it will become fifth root of 2 minus a power 5. And RHS will be 2 minus A. Now I will add A to both sides or take this minus 1 to the left hand side. So equation will become A plus fifth root of 2 minus A power 5 equal to 2. Now I will use substitution. Let us call this is equal to B power 5. So let 2 minus a power 5 equal to b power 5. So from here I can write a power 5 plus b power 5. This will be equal to our first equation. And second equation will come from the original one. a plus fifth root of b power 5 equal to 2. So fifth root and power 5 it will be cancelled out a plus b equal to so we have now one new system these two equations and we have to find the value of a only once a is known x is known so let's solve this new system i will write both the equations a power 5 plus b power 5 equal to 2 and second equation a plus b equal to 2. I will begin with this equation. Let me consider squaring both sides. So I will write here a square plus b square plus twice ab equal to 2 square is 4. Now let us assume ab equal to t. So our equation, it will be a square plus b square plus 2t equal to 4 or a square plus b square value, this will be 4 minus 2t. Let me consider this is our third equation. Now I will consider cubing both sides. So a plus b whole cube equal to 2 whole cube a plus b whole cube formula a cube plus b cube plus 3 a b in bracket a plus b right hand side is 8 let's put both the values a plus b is 2 and a b is equal to t so i can write a cube plus b cube plus 3 times t times 2 equal to 8 a cube plus b cube plus 60 equal to 8 or a cube plus b cube this will be equal to 8 minus 60 now this is our second equation now i will multiply these two equations and I will utilize a power 5 plus b power 5 equal to 2 also. 
let's multiply these two first so i will write a square plus b square times a cube plus b cube equal to 4 minus 2t in second bracket 8 minus 6t let's multiply a square with a cube a power 5 b square with b cube b power 5 plus cross product a square with b cube a square b cube b square with a cube a cube b square right hand side i will be writing 4 minus 2t and then from this bracket i will take 2 common 4 minus 3t now a power 5 plus b power 5 is 2 so let me write here 2 plus from these two terms i will take a square b square common out so in bracket it would be b plus a or a plus b equal to 2 times 4 minus 2t 4 minus 3t now let us put ab is equal to 2 ab is equal to t not 2 so a square b square will be t square a plus b is 2 2 times 4 minus 2t 4 minus 3t divide this equation by 2 as it is divisible by 2 so i will be writing 1 plus t square equal to 4 minus 2t times 4 minus 3t so i'll be writing further t square plus 1 equal to 4 times 4 is 16 minus 20t plus 60 square take all the term to rhs i will be having 5t square minus 20t plus 15 equal to 0 one quadratic equation in t and remember t was a b equation is divisible by 5 so i will divide i will write t square minus 4t plus 3 equal to 0 t square minus 4t plus 3 equal to 0 let us factorize t square minus let me write here minus 3t minus t plus 3 equal to 0 t is common from first two so i will write t minus 3 minus 1 is common so t minus 3 once again so it will become t minus 1 times t minus 3 equal to 0 conclusion is t is equal to 1 t is equal to 3 now let me write what was t t was our substitution a b so i can write the equation a plus b equal to so let us write two system once again let me write here a plus b equal to 2 and a b equal to 1 one system and second system a plus b equal to 2 and a b equal to 3 this time let's solve both the equation one by one so i will write a plus b equal to 2 and a b equal to 1 second equation a plus b equal to 2 and a b equal to 3 so consider one quadratic equation in a itself whose roots are a and b so this one is sum of roots this one is product of roots so let me write a square minus sum of roots so 2a plus product of roots 1 equal to 0 here a square minus sum of roots plus product of roots equal to 0 now i will write quadratic formula or it is one perfect square so it is a minus 1 whole square equal to 0 or a is equal to 1 and 1 here i will apply quadratic form so minus b 2 plus minus under the root b square 4 minus 4ac 
so minus 12 divided by 2a i can write 2 plus minus this is square root minus 8 so i can write i outside and 2 root divided by 2 so a, a is coming out 1 plus minus i root a is 1 and 1 here now a was our substitution let me put our substitution back it was x minus 20 so i will be writing here a is equal to 1 1 1 plus minus i root a was x minus 20 it will be 1 multiplicity 2 1 plus minus i root 2 now add 20 to both sides so 1 plus 20 21 and if i will add 20 here then 21 plus minus i root 2 so here we are having four solutions 21 is having multiplicity 2 and two complex solutions 21 plus minus i root this brings the end of this video friends bye bye till next video do not forget to like share and subscribe Bye-bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye-bye.